Saints fan and songwriter Al Dockin Jr. has composed a catchy folk rock song that captures the frustration of the Houdat Nation in the wake of the game that must not be mentioned. At this writing, Dockin's musical Facebook video has garnered more than 200,000 views and 13,000 thumbs up. But we can't recommend you go to Al Dockin's eponymously named Facebook page to listen to watch his recording of the angsty anthem, because of an objectionable phrase, they crushed our dreams, they broke our hearts, he sings like a more gravelly Jimmy Buffett. The game was rigged right from the start, the Saints played well, they did their job. They did everything right, but they still got robbed. I hope you're happy Rams fans, with your win and you asterisks but the way that you won was a whole lot of, here's where the song drifts past NOLA.com standards, as Dockin gustily applies a colloquialism for bovine waste that is sometimes used to imply a falsehood or, in this case, an injustice, I'm still infuriated, said Dockin in a telephone conversation. I've never been a conspiracy theory kind of guy, but you almost feel they, the NFL, wanted it done this way, Dockin has a history of Saints commentary. As he explained, back in the 1990s, sportscaster extraordinaire Buddy DeLaberto expressed his frustration with the perennially losing Saints by declaring that if the team ever made it to the Super Bowl he'd walk down Poydras Street wearing a dress. According to Dawkin, DeLaberto added that, considering his stoutness, it wouldn't be a dress, it would be a tent. This prompted Dawkin to begin phoning DeLaberto on air posing as, Abdul D. Tentmaker, an imaginary character that became part of Saints lore. Boycott Bowl concert could compete with Super Bowl for disgruntled Saints audience Thomister. Tentmaker eventually went by the wayside, Dawkin has continued to demonstrate his devotion with black and gold musical parodies. Dawkin said he gigs regularly along the Gulf Coast as part of the duo known as Birdie's Boys. He said he's been invited to play opposite the Super Bowl on February 3 at Rockin' Bowl. Between now and then, he plans to re-record his NFL Cattle Affluence Anthem minus the unprintable words. New Orleans Bars, Restaurants Hosting. Contact him via email at dmcash at nola.com. Follow him on Twitter at Doug McCash and on Facebook at Douglas James McCash. As always, please add your point of view to the comment stream.